welcome to my channel thank you so much for joining me on today's video if you are returning thank you for always watching and if you're new on here welcome on board today is another day of my fragma series and i thank you for joining me so today i am dedicating this video to raquel she's my subscriber and she is always asking me for layering combinations she loves layering combinations and particularly she has asked for one with a woody sweet fragrance that i am currently going crazy over this one is called ragba wood intense this is sweet smoky and woody and it is absolutely stunning so she's asked for layering ideas for this perfume. Now, if you do not have this one, because this is from the house of Latafa, it's a Middle Eastern fragrance. And I know that not everybody here is down with Middle Eastern fragrances, but not to worry. If you have any woody, smoky type of fragrance, I feel like it might go well, or these perfumes that I'm going to suggest might go well with them as well. But... That being said, let me show you what I have for you today. So first off, we're going to start with Ragba Wood Intense and Dolce and Gabbana, the only one eau de parfum. Of course, the only one eau de parfum is caramel. It's coffee. So of imagine layering it with Ragba Wood Intense, the woody, smoky fragrance. You just feel like you have like toasted coffee right so toasted coffee with some caramel flavoring absolutely amazing and when i'm talking about toasted coffee it's like that kind of roasting the coffee beans in a fireplace type of thing that's the kind of scent that you would get from this add some woodiness add some depth add some structure to the only one not to say that the only one is not good on its own but the marriage of those two fragrances especially with the coffee and the caramel and the smoke and the woods stunning next up i have girl of now elisab so again it's that sweetness so we're looking to layer the sweetness the sweet 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 tooth achingly sweet fragrances with the smoky woods Girl of Now is your nutty, very pistachio, almond type of fragrance. Now imagine that with a smoky wood fragrance. You feel like you're getting roasted pistachios, you know, dipped in some syrupy base. Absolutely amazing. This one I love. It's very sexy. And this one will get you compliments. I actually did. Because for all these combos, I wasted a bit of time because I was trying them out myself. I wouldn't want to bring something that I haven't tried. This worked very well. And this got me compliments, actually. So I love this because it projects. On a normal day, Girl of Now projects for me. So layering it with Ragba Wood Intense just amped up that strength of the perfume and made it stunning okay so next up we have layering with a gold couture now gold couture is caramel obviously so i'm sure you see a pattern here the sweetness this you know sugary caramelly that kind of thing that's what goes very well with a woody smoky fragrance because then there's a balance of the intensity with the sweetness this one is just middle eastern princess <laughs> take it away so yes of course there's caramel in gold couture add that to the wood intense what it just does is it sweetens ragba it makes it a lot more flirty a lot more girly absolutely amazing you would love this one especially if you like sweet sweet type of fragrances next up i have a very obvious layering combination yes this is another caramel bomb this is ragba the original so this is eau de parfum again like i said another caramel bomb people have compared this to pink sugar 
what I think it smells like is a street snack from when I was much younger. So it was like caramelized sugar on a stick. And it used to be shaped like a cone. It used to be like a very popular street snack when I was much younger. And if you grew up in Nigeria, please let me know because that was the bomb at the time. I can't remember what we used to call it, the local name. I can't remember. But it was so nice then. Anyway, so that's what this smells like. And imagine layering it with woods. It's just... It goes without saying, right? It's an absolute no-brainer. Sweetness, woodiness, smokiness, you know. All right, so there's another one that I think goes very well. And when I tried it, I also got quite a number of compliments from my colleagues on this one. So let's see. This is Belle by Ahar May. Now, Belle is in the league of the likes of Givenchy's Dahlia Devine. So berries, a little bit of rose playing somewhere in the middle. I can't remember if there's patchouli somewhere in this fragrance. I believe there might be. So it leans in the direction of Belle. Um, sorry. <laughs> it leans in the direction of Dahlia Devine. I'm just using that to let you understand the kind of perfume. It's like a fruity floral, very playful, very flirty, very easy reach, no brainer type of perfume. Layer it with ragba wood in terms and it, it just becomes like this sexy, very nighttime, very Jessica rabbity type of fragrance. Amazing guys, this takes our Hermaine's Bell to a whole nother level that I didn't think was possible. And you know that berry-like sweetness can be very lush and juicy. And when you add the woodiness, it just makes it a lot more sophisticated than it really is. And it's so stunning, guys. I particularly like this one. So if you have any fragrance that is fruity, floral, berry-like, all of that, try it with wood intense and tell me what you think. Okay, so this one now is taking it in a little bit of a gourmandish direction. Not like the others weren't gourmands anyway, but this one is a different direction. So this is layering it with chocolate. Now, this is Choco Musk from our rehab. It's a very cheap, cheerful, chocolate-based fragrance. Whew. Now, what this reminds me of is like if I'm sitting in a cafe having some coffee by the fireplace so there's a live fireplace with some woods burning and all that and i'm sipping my coffee that's it and it's just a lovely smell it's very comforting you can you kind of feel like you want to wrap whoever wears this in a warm hug this feels very sweater weather appropriate in fact most of these combos will work very very well in cold weather so it's either i do a rehab or i layer it with hugo boss the scent private accord so choco mask hugo boss the scent any one of them or any chocolate fragrance you have would do so last for today we're going to layer this with a rose fragrance let me balance this this is lancome's idol stunning this is belle of the ball this is arabian princess this is beautiful and elegant idol is an elegant fragrance in and of itself but if you want to add a twist to it if you want to switch it up a bit if you want to give it a middle eastern tinge if you want to make it a lot more a lot deeper a lot richer pair it with ragba wood intense you won't regret it it makes it a woody rose you know and i mean it all on its own has rose it has vanilla but pairing it with ragba wood intense just makes it a different type of fragrance now how do i do these pairings i would say do what works for you and the reason i say that is for some people what works for them is to layer on top so you put the ragba at the base which to me is like the more intense one of all these fragrances i've shown and then you put the layering pair the layering um fragrance on top of it and see what they become when you know both fragrances mesh together another option is to use one fragrance on one side of your body and 
the other on the other side and then see what it becomes in the air so the two fragrances wafting through the air and just mixing that way i feel like there's no science to it like i always say whichever one works it's fun so just play around with it and see which one you like best okay i have one combo that i missed out let me just quickly show that one Ragba Wood Intense with Dates Delight from the house of U. Dates Delight is syrupy, sweet, very nice, Middle Eastern leaning type of fragrance, even though it doesn't have any woods in it, or at least I don't get any wood from it. Layering it with Ragba Wood Intense just completes its Middle Eastern <laughs> baptism. <laughs> So it just makes it feel more like a Middle Eastern fragrance. It makes it have more depth, more structure. Sometimes sweet perfumes can be a bit one-dimensional, especially if they don't have anything backing them up or any base notes that give a lot more depth to them. So this adds a lot of depth to Date's Delight and it just makes it a lot more sexy, a lot more appealing, a lot more sultry than, you know, than it already is. So guys... These are my layering combos for today. Raquel, this is specially for you. Thank you for always watching and supporting. And to everybody, if, you, if there's any kind of video you want me to make, please leave a comment below and I will definitely attempt to make it for you. Thank you so much for always watching. Until I see you on another video, enjoy the rest of your day or night. Bye.